number one, appreciate you inviting me to do this. Um, I appreciate Maya and Vosh and everybody else for like, you know, putting progressive victory and, and, um, and, and progress libs and, and definitely the coalition that they built together and, and things like that. And everybody who's contributed, um, this is a big deal. Um, I think for various reasons, because like, you know, I still have a full-time job and I know a lot of people do, we, we tend to get distracted by things. And if we do pay attention to politics, it's usually on a national level. Um, I'm glad that enough attention is being drawn to this because our system of federalism can fool us. Like some of these key elections like can have outsized impact, but they don't have the profile, right? And progress libs and progressive victory are really de devoting the resources to maximizing what we're trying to do here. If, you know, April 4th comes and, and Judge Protasewicz loses, hopefully she doesn't, but if it happens, uh, I don't think it'll be because there was a lack of effort on our part. Um, everybody who's participated in the phone banking and in the canvassing, they've really given quite a bit of their time, effort, and energy. And there's still stuff to be done. Again, the election's not till April 4th. It is April 1st. We've yep. got time to still make a difference. So canvassing and phone banking, it's really important. Exclamation point, canvas, exclamation point, phone bank. And again, they'll set you up for success. The literature the training, the resources, the people to lean on. You are not alone. Every introvert, because again, the, the vast majority of people I canvassed with were introverts. They were people who by their own admission never thought they would do anything like this, but they felt the civic duty. They felt the compulsion to do that and they felt sufficiently supported. You will too, promise you, you will too. The odds of you having a negative experience, incredibly low. It's but again, even canvassing, because it's not like every door you knock on, somebody will answer. Right, it's like a 30% rate of people who answer. Most, time, most of the times you'll just be knocking doors and leaving literature behind. It's so important. We have to keep Daniel Kelly out of the seat. This is a rare opportunity to undo a lot of Republican shenaniganry, I guess I would call it, <laughs> in Wisconsin. Undo, potentially undo the gerrymandering, but we've got a split 50-50 state, and they have tried to legislate their way into a supermajority because they don't play fair. They know in a fair fight they'll probably lose. Yep. So they will min-max and try to rig the game, and they won't stop. That they don't even campaign on platforms anymore, folks. It's just about rigging the damn game. This is a chance to not only stop them from rigging it further, but to undo the rigging that they've done. Yep. This is so important. So please, if you can contribute, if you can donate or canvas or phone bank, this is extremely important. And uh, yeah, so go Judge Janet, April 4th, and uh, go democracy. Go democracy. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for coming out. I, I really, really appreciate it. Um, yeah, absolutely. You, you've been fantastic.